Here we have Cecil's first swim. So right now what we can see is that the head is pointing upwards and the legs are trailing down just a little bit. So we want everything to fit within the chest depth. So right now we can see the feet are lower than that. So that's going to cause you some drag. To fix that, we worked on getting the head down and the hands entering sooner and deeper and then engaging the glutes to keep the legs up and together. So in this position, when your head's in the right position, everything rotates nicely on its axis. The legs are coming up closer to the surface of the water. Hands are going down, which is a better place to grab the water with. So we always want to have the fingertips relaxed and down. And on breathing, notice the hand was a little on the high side. So anytime we see the hand start to reach up near the surface, we're going to see the legs start to drop down. So over the water here. So we can see that the elbow is hitting the water at the time that you're entering in. So that, that's resistance on forward momentum. If we can keep a high elbow and a low hand and slide the hand in with no resistance, then we're not going to have that breaking action every time your arm goes in the water. So here we were working on getting that elbow high and to swing through, swing the elbow forward, keep the hand underneath. So if we watch closely, we should see a lot less splash with that elbow because it's high. The hand is separating the water to allow the elbow to enter and it should be the hip that's putting the whole arm into the water here. So really nicely done. Notice everything's nice and horizontal here. And from the front, so here we're looking to make sure that the hands are at least shoulder width apart. And that gives us our stability in the water. And here we can see you're reaching towards the center line. And we see the thighs just a little bit. So here we want to see those hands come apart and enter in front of the shoulder. So if we extend in front of the shoulder, then we can maintain our stability in the water as well. The second the hands want to creep in too narrow, we lose some of our power and increase some of the issues with the shoulders. So this is much better here. Okay, hands can still enter slightly lower on your right hand side. It has a tendency to want to flare up. Good work.